to be the greatest person of the 20th century. And that person is? Alan Turing. <laughs> A while enduring deserves the accolade. So popular here, of the greatest person of the 20th century. He was a man who worked almost entirely in secret, who received little credit for cracking the Nazi codes and shortening the war, and who died having been branded a criminal. Today, he's the most celebrated figure of the 20th century. The father of computing, war hero, and genius, Alan Turing. Do you feel like you've done him proud? Do you, are you, do you feel happy? I'm extraordinarily pleased because I think it was a plea for tolerance uh, for different minds, for different sexualities, for different religions and colours, and that's what we need. Going forward, we are one species on one planet with one big problem, and we need those scientists to help us. And I think that if there's someone out there in their bedroom tonight having a tough time because they're autistic, but they've got the brilliant mind that Turing had, then maybe this will give them the confidence to stand up and change the world. Thank you. Here to accept the trophy on his behalf, we're delighted to welcome Alan Turing's niece, Ina Payne. Thank you so much. Lovely to meet you. Chris, please, yes, will you present? Thank you. Thank you. Now, what unites all the great figures we've heard about tonight is that they inspired us. They were all change makers, each one of them has had an impact on the lives we live today. If you want to look closer into what makes an icon, go to bbc.co.uk forward slash icons and follow the links to the Open University where academic experts explore what lies behind a reputation. We would like to say an enormous thank you to all of our advocates, to everyone who's joined the debate, both here, thank you audience, and at home this evening. And mainly, thank you so much for watching. Good night. Good night.